Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to learn how to add a column to a data frame in Pandas. First, we're just going to load in Pandas and a data set to use. And we're actually going to show three ways to do this. First, we're going to show how to do it by direct column assignment. So to add a column this way, you just type the name of the data frame. And then within square brackets, you directly add in whatever the new column's name is going to be in quotes. So here we're going to call the new column new one. And then you just set it equal to the values that you want to put in the new column. In some cases, this might be a list of values that you already have. In this case, we're just going to set it equal to whether the MPG column that's already in this data frame is greater than 20. So we'll run that and we see that the new column we made here, new one, has been added to the end of this data frame. Now you'll notice when we added a column this way, using the new column name as an index and then setting it equal to our new column, it added the column at the end. If we wanted to add the new column at a given index position instead of at the end, we can use the insert method on data frames to do that instead. So here method two, we're going to use dot insert. So to do that, we're going to again take our data frame MT cars, but this time we're gonna say we wanna use the dot insert method and then we're just going to pass in some arguments here. The first argument is the index where we want to insert the new column. So we're going to insert it at index position two. The next argument is the name. So we're going to call this new column new two. And then the last argument here is what we're going to insert or the, the values. So again, we're just going to insert another logical column here. And when we run that, we see that the new two column has been inserted at index position two. So now we'll go over one final way that we could add new columns to a data frame. You can also use the dot assign method on data frames in pandas. And what this will do is actually create a brand new data frame using the columns from the original data frame and then adding any additional columns that you pass into it as arguments. So you can add multiple columns at the same time using this. So we're going to say mtcars.assign and then we're just passing in some new columns. So we're gonna say we want the column new three to be added and it's gonna equal this. And we also want the column new four to be added and it's gonna be equal to this. And notice that we're not just calling this on its own. We're having to say empty cars equals this because this is creating a whole new data frame. So if we didn't save this as anything, we would kind of create it and then it would just be lost. So the original empty cars wouldn't be overwritten. We have to explicitly say we want the original empty cars to be overwritten equals by this new data frame we're creating. And when we do that, we will run head again, and we can see that indeed we added two new columns this time, new three and new four. I will include all of the code used in this video in the description below for easy copy and paste access. If you found this video useful, you can drop a like, and I'll see you again next time.